Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another reaction video. Today, we'll be reacting to Led Zeppelin, Bring It On Home. This is the last song of Led Zeppelin to the album. And um, I never really thought that I'd be doing a track by track, you know, album in that kind of order. I never thought I'd be doing it, but Led Zeppelin has just got me hooked onto it, you know. Um, it feels like, it feels like a trip back to the past, you know. Um, and I feel like I'm experiencing it and not alone, you know, with you guys who have experience in this band, you know, who knows a lot, much more than I do. Nonetheless, it feels less lonely, you know, <laughs> if that makes sense. Anyway, we have Led Zeppelin, Bring It On Home. We have the lyrics, which will be uh, on my phone, you know, it's, you know how, the, how it goes already. And we have the live version, which is the Royal Albert, you know, 1970, which is just my favorite ever. So, yeah, uh, if you guys do enjoy the video, please do leave a like, subscribe. Let's, let's get on with it. Hmm. Damn, that starts off very bluesy, you know, and then all of a sudden, I was wondering, like, you know, where's, um, or more or less, when is Paige going to come in? And all of a sudden, boom, you know, it just dropped. And yeah, very bluesy song, it feels like, you know, it feels like it's just that uh, chilled vibe, you know, something that you just relax to, you know, you listen to. But I can see how, um, how this song can really trick you, you know, in many ways, like, um, it got you at the first wondering what's going on and then all of a sudden, boom, it hit you. <laughs> Thank you. 
Mm. Wow, this one was quite unique, uh, something different, like, you know, it caught me off guard in the beginning. And I was thinking to myself, like, is this really Robert, you know, like, um, what's going on here now? Am I going to listen to something totally different? And all of a sudden, boom, you know. So, yeah, I kind of dig this one, you know, it has that vibe to it. And um, it just feels like... It feels like I could just vibe to it, you know? It's so chilled, like, you just, you know, relax to a song like this. You really feel like you're bringing it on at home. <laughs> anyway, we have the uh, live version, which is, you know, always fire. So, yeah, let's check this out. Ah.
Love that performance. That was really nice. Um, I never thought I'd hear um Robert play the harmonica. I think it's the harmonica, but um, well done. Like I really love that performance. That performance had everything I want from a Led Zeppelin performance. You know, it had Jimmy. It had my man on the drums. It had yeah, it just had everything going for it. You know, um, ah, I'm definitely gonna listen to the song again. Like um, songs like these, like. I feel like um, this is one hell of a way to end the second album, you know. And when one door closes, another opens. So the third album to Led Zeppelin, I'll have to see which it is. I'm not sure myself. You know, it's exciting to know, but um, I really love this one. Um, it had it all, you know. And Led Zeppelin as a band is just—they are a piece of history now that will forever. Is my hope to remain, you know, and forever be known. It's like so many other bands and singers out there, you know, actors, legends who's made it. I'm sure they'll remain. If you guys did enjoy the video, please do leave a like, subscribe, and yeah, I will see you guys. One. <laughs>